See these soft, delightful pillows that are depicted behind me? These pictures belay a much sadder reality. We are talking about the tragedy that happened at the traditional pillow fight at West Point. That's right, 30 people were hurt as the pillow fight turned rough. Okay, here's a story. So West Point, obviously, uh, historic military academy, generally has a pretty good reputation. Some, some weird things have happened there over the ages. Um, but generally, West Point, you know, tends to be a uh, pretty good reputation. Okay, so one of their traditions is they have this massive pillow fight every year. It's allegedly created to help the cadets blow off steam after their tough first summer of basic training. Now, there was a pillow fight held on August 20th, and it got rough. 30 members of the class of 2019 required medical attention. 24 of them suffered concussions. Right. These are people who we're going to send to help us kill other people. Okay, injuries included a broken nose, dislocated shoulder, hairline fracture of a cheekbone. All students have returned to duty. No one died, but still a bad idea. Now, it doesn't appear that anyone has ever suffered concussions in such a ridiculous fashion in a previous one, but what some people are saying is that some of these people, they go by the name of plebes apparently, uh, I guess that means undergrad, um, were swinging around pillowcases with hard objects, right? Um, so obviously this is cause for concern for a lot of reasons. Um, I don't know, I thought the military was founded on discipline and following the rules and all that. Clearly the pillow fight is not meant to give 24 people concussions. Um, that's, that's one thing, right? Um, if you watch the video about it, I don't know, I feel like the whole tradition is really weird. Like there's a YouTube video and people, they're going at it. They're beating the crap out of each other. Um, so I don't know, maybe is it time to rethink this tradition or maybe is it time to rethink putting hard objects in pillowcases and then beating people with them? It's up for you to decide. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe.